Welcome back. I hope you've had a great Easter and feel like you've had a good break. It might not have felt exactly like a normal holiday because most of you have been out of school for quite a while and you won't have come back in for the new term. But a few of us are still about though. My hair's a bit longer and you'll be pleased or disappointed that I've resisted a homemade buzz cut. So whatever it is you've done over Easter, I hope you're feeling refreshed and ready for the new term. And maybe you've tried something new or rediscovered something that you always used to do but haven't done for a while. I dug out my old Unisaga from the garage and I rode it for the first time in about 10 years and I was delighted I could still do it, even on my relatively aged legs. And I cooked gnocchi for the first time ever. I made an incredible mess of our kitchen and they were disgusting, so I don't think I'll be doing that again soon, but I enjoyed taking the challenge. Now this is a new term for our remote learning. We at school are all doing our best to make it as good as possible and better than ever, and I know that you'll want the same thing too. We are all here to support you, and I appreciate the challenges you'll be facing. This term, we're aiming for most lessons to be live according to the timetable. This should make the lessons better and help everyone get into a good routine. You'll also have a form period every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday morning, where your tutors will check in with you to see that you're okay and where you can raise any concerns. We plan to offer video assemblies every Tuesday morning too. So please do get in the habit of checking your emails, getting used to your calendar and being online for lessons wherever possible. And if this is impossible for you, we're recording lessons too, and you can talk to your form tutor about that or anything else if you're unsure. In general though, our expectation is that you attend lessons, you work hard and do your best, just as if you were at school. For those of you in year 11 and year 13, hopefully you read my letter to you last term, but we'll be sending out some information so that everyone knows exactly what's happening. So here we are, it's the summer term of 2020. It will not be like any other term, but there's no reason for it not to be fantastic. Thank you again for getting stuck in. I look forward to seeing you all again when we're able to gather.